food is something that's really underestimated down here in the ground. Like people go like, oh yeah, I'm gonna fly to space. I don't care what food I take. It's not bad. Well, you start caring about that one month into the mission, and then if you made the wrong decisions, it's it's a it's a hard remaining five months. This is mainly to trigger my memory for the food that I already had, and now I can make the choices based on how I remember them. And then there's a few new ones in between. For them, I have to sort of guess. There's still debate if the taste actually changes uh, the actual taste buds. If people perceive taste differently, uh, my personal opinion is we don't. I think it's the same, but the cravings change, and that is really hard to predict. Right now, I might not care so much for broccoli and cauliflower, but up there, I really liked it. I because it's it's pretty protein loaded. What we have, we have a lot of uh, meats, and then I tried to add anything that reminds me of something green. Let's put it that way. I mean, those beans they yeah. <laughs> they don't resemble uh, beans a lot, but they actually taste really nice. Well, we didn't have blueberries last time, right? We had right. raisins. Mm. That stuff is awesome. Last time I got a few Russian bonus containers. They also have very, very good food. Their food is more succulent, like they have more, more grease in there, also more spices, also more salt, which is not so good for the bones. So I tried not to eat so much of it. The American food or the European food is, is more healthy, I would say. Uh, but once in a while it, it's really satisfying to just open one a can of this really uh, succulent, savory Russian food and I absolutely enjoyed it. It's really good. On my last uh, expedition we tried to have the meals all together. The US crew, the European crew together, uh, we always had meals together when, when we could. And then on the weekends we would gather, like the six of us. Either the Russians would invite us to their segment or we would invite them. And then we have the big table and everybody brings something together and it's kind of this medley. That's important. Uh, this, those are the relaxation moments. Uh, you can take your time, you put music on and you chat about how your week went. And it's the last thing that I have for today, after a successful tasting of 48 items. <laughs>